Hi, I'm Melissa and I'm a senior designer here at Queensbury. It's really important to take the time in setting up a web page as it can increase search engine rankings and it will save you a lot of time later on if you wish to share this page on any social media platform. So what we want to do is we want to go to the back end of Workspace and to Website in the navigation. To add a new page, we click Add Page on the right hand side here. But what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open an existing page that I've already set up and go through that. So we want to go to About Page. Great. And I'm going to talk you through this section here. So page title displays at the top of browsers and in search engines. Navigation text displays in the navigation menu. URL, now this is the URL slug for this page. So for example, visionarydemo.queensburyworkspace.com slash about. Now meta keywords and meta description are very important and this should never be left blank. The meta keywords help tell search engines what the topic of the page is. This is so important as it can help direct potential clients to your site. Meta description displays on search engine result pages. This needs to just be a short description telling the searcher what they can expect by clicking your link and why they should visit your page. There are great articles online covering metadata, so I'd suggest doing a little bit of research if this is the first time setting this up. And if we want to just go to the right hand side here, we've got feature image. The feature image is used for social media purposes. For example, if you want to share this page on Facebook, the feature image will appear alongside the meta description. And if you want to change the feature image, you go click here, and you can either upload an image, grab one from your events, or your media library. This part up here is the page status section. You can show your navigation in your page or hide it. It states when the page was last updated and also this is where you delete the page. You would save the page if you weren't quite finished and you wanted to work on it later on. You can preview the page while you're currently working on it. I always do this before I publish the page. And obviously publish is when you're ready for it to go live. Publishing the page also saves the page. And just another feature that we've got on the page here is previous revisions. Page revision is a really good tool if you want to revert back to an old page that you've worked on. So before reverting, I would suggest previewing the page just to make sure you're happy with it. So that sums up our page settings. Thanks for watching. Bye.